Hey, what's going on guys? I'm um, just coming at you with an autograph recap of the Cleveland Cavaliers. Uh, they were here Friday, January 10th. Um, I did pretty well. Um, I got 10 cards, 16 photos, 4 jerseys, 2 basketballs, so 32 total. Um, so let's start off with the cards. Um, I got Austin Carr, really nice guy. I really love his auto. Um, it's just really cool. Um, the next one was Sergei. Sergey. Karasev, I think that's how you say his name, really nice, and then I got uh, Karik Felix, I think that's how you say his name, um, he, he had a silver marker in his hand, and um, I asked him if he could change, and he's like, oh yeah, no problem, so he's signing gold, and I got two from Earl Clark, and then I got one from Tyler Zeller, and I also got a photo from him also. And then I got three but one card from CJ Miles. I you know, last year he only was signing zero on everything like from his jazz days. He'll do CJ zero, but this year he's been doing CJ thirty four, which is really cool. And uh and then I got three from Anderson Vergeo, one in silver, and then he switched to blue. Gotta see him back and healthy. And then for photos, oh, I, I got one from Matthew Della Vadova. Really nice on a logo, 5x7. It's funny because when he signed his name, he put 9, and he actually wears number 8. And he's like, after he signed, he's like, oh, I put my wrong number. And I said, oh, that's fine. So I guess I got a, 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 you know, a unique auto from him. And then... Next one, I got another one from Karasev Sergey on a logo sheet because I didn't have a card for him. And then I got one from Alonzo G. I had two out, but he only signed one. So that's he was the only one that I put out more than, and he only signed one of them. And then here's the photo I got from last year that I didn't get signed from Tyler Zeller. Came out gold, great with the gold. On a five by seven, and then for eight by tens, I got two from Austin Card on this high this college photo, and he's like, "Oh, brought back the vintage photo," and I, I said, yeah, "Of course," and I got him in gold. I did five by sevens last year of this photo, so I thought, "Why not do an eight by ten since he signed it so nice." And then I got one from Jared Jack. He, um, I just was going to do um, cards, but I really like this photo and I like how he signs. So um, I like this photo and I loved how he signed it in silver. You can kind of, you know, it's better off camera, but right in the middle and he made it so nice, so big and just really nice guy. Um, and then I got Tristan Thompson. He only signed for me and this other kid. Like, people didn't even really see him come off the court. And um, when I asked him, he didn't really look like he wanted to sign. And he didn't even push down on the marker, hardly. So it kind of, you know, he did the T good, but you can barely see the auto. So it's not a good auto from him, but oh well. At least I got him. I don't, that's what, you know, matters. And then... I got three from Anthony Bennett. I had help with this one. Really, really nice guy, especially being a, a number one pick. Um, I feel bad that he's not really getting the chance to play and he's struggling, um, but he's really nice. I used a paint pen. It kind of he kind of splattered it, but came out nice. I thought he was kind of kind of be a not a jerk, but I thought he was going to be kind of like all big on himself for being number one pick, but he is actually a really, really down-to-earth nice guy. And then I got three from Dion Waiters. Really nice. I was talking to him about how cute his son is, and that, like, totally sparked, uh, sparked his, you know, interest in talking, and he, yeah, he has, it's really cute how he loves his son a lot, and Love to talk about him. 
And then I got a third one. My same photo. And I'm so happy to finally get this guy. It's been tough trying to get him the last three years. Um, and that was actually his first game as a as a Cav. Uh, Luau Dang. I was actually getting to talk to him because I guess his mom is... He was. There was a story that said that his mom didn't understand really why he got traded. So I was talking to him about that. And and he was saying, yeah, she, she wasn't understanding at first. But um, after talking to her a little bit and understanding what... What, how this business is she's more understanding and so it was fun to talk to him about that um and next i last year like actually two years ago they did a a sale like a big huge super sell after the season where um everything that they were selling from jerseys some jerseys uh, like cj raja bell and Devin Harris, they were all a dollar, so I pretty much bought all the CJ Miles I could find, and some of the Devin Harrises, and so they were a dollar, and I actually got four signed last year, and and uh, CJ put CJ zero, which is his cab number number, but this year I was excited because I had two left, and he actually did CJ thirty four on them. I was so excited. Came out really nice, especially for a dollar. And I can't complain about him doing CJ Zero on the other ones because it's just a dollar jerseys. And they're swingmen too. Really nice. I was actually talking to him about how we miss him here and and it, and happy that, you know, he's playing well and he was going off on threes like a couple games ago before they were here. And really nice. And here's the second one. Kind of signed sideways, but came out good. Can't complain for being a dollar. Um, and next I got four total from Kyrie Irving. I actually got them on two jerseys. Uh, this one. I don't know if you guys notice, but every time Kyrie signs, his, his auto is completely different. But his K is always consistent, pretty much. So I got him on that one. And then I got him on the jersey in the background. See, it's kind of, it's just, the K is consistent, but the rest is just never <laughs> exactly like the other ones. So, as long as this K is consistent, I, I don't care. So, at least people can understand that you actually got his, his autograph and not just like a forged autograph. So, so I got two jerseys. And then I'll show you an example. I actually had help on these ones. My dad helped me on them. So I got him to sign a ball on a paint pen, and this is mine, and yeah, it just, he didn't really use the paint pen very well, like he was signing it with one hand, and it got stuck, so he just kind of didn't really finish, and he just kind of left it like that, but I don't guess, okay, I don't care. And then here's the other one. It's kind of, yeah, that one came out better. So yeah, these <laughs> didn't really, they're totally different, I'll show you. See, those, yeah, the K's, yeah, it just kind of, I don't know, I might be willing to sell this one if anyone's interested and make me an offer on this one. I'll be generous, but yeah, those, those are my autographs. So I did pretty well, other than that, great signing team. Uh, thanks you guys so much for watching. Have a good one.